What's up all my movie loving maniacs? This is your boy Bankful B of The Last of the Factor and there is no weekly movie rundown this week because one of the movies that I watched last week, I really want to do a more longer review of that movie. And no, it's not the movie that I'm getting ready to review now. It's actually another movie that came out 10 years ago. And hopefully I'll have that review up, hopefully by Thursday. But to give you a hint as to what movie it is, it's a movie that came out 10 years ago and is directed by David Fincher. But for right now, let's talk about Ladder 49, which came out 20 years ago. It's celebrating its 20th anniversary this month. And I figured, A, Joaquin Phoenix, he was in Joker Folly Do which came out last weekend, and so I revisited this film, which is Ladder 49, a movie that I remember renting from Blockbuster 20 years ago, and I thought it was a pretty good film, but also a very sad film. I, I remember 20 years ago, I did not this movie to have the ending that it had. But Ladder 49, it chronicles the life of a fireman that gets stuck under some rumble in a building that was on fire, and he basically recounts his entire life from when he became a firefighter, when he, became, when, when he got married, and when he started a family, and the dangers of being a fireman. Joaquin Phoenix is that fireman, and his captain is John Travolta. Now, like I said, I remember when I watched this movie back in the day, it was very sad. It's basically just... A movie chronicling the life of a fireman and then for him to have the sad ending, spoiler alert, he does die. And the movie ends with his funeral and everybody celebrating all the wonderful things that he did. Now, how do I feel about this movie 20 years later? I mean, I pretty much feel the same way I did 20 years ago. It's still a little bit sad and with adult eyes, I do see that it is a little bit sappy. And on a filmmaking standpoint, it doesn't really do anything spectacular. But I will give glory to all the fire scenes. Like, this movie definitely does have some of the best fireman scenes that I've seen in any movie. Granted, I haven't seen that many fireman scenes. But this one right here, it definitely puts some emphasis on the fact of... Hey, being a fireman, it is a dangerous job. And I think some of these scenes with all the buildings that are on fire are pretty real too. In fact, there's one scene where Joaquin Phoenix's character, he has to save someone from a skyscraper and he has to go on a little harness. He's on a wire, I should say, and he has to save somebody. But being a fireman, we get to see how this also causes friction between him and his wife in the movie. And she doesn't really want to, want him to take on these dangerous jobs that come with being a fireman. And all his friends that are part of the fire department that he works at, they are all just dying left and right. And Morris Chestnut, he's in the movie one point, he gets burnt the fuck up. And side note, how y'all gonna do that to the black man in this movie? But aside from all that, I say Joaquin Phoenix, he was basically good in this movie. John Travolta, he's always good in most things that he's in. He does a good job at playing the hardened captain, but at the same time, he still has a heart of gold. And he's reacquainted with Joaquin Phoenix and his family. And he's basically the mentor to Joaquin Phoenix's character. Some other actors that I definitely did not know was in this movie 20 years ago when I saw it was Robert Patrick and um, Billy Burke, who plays the dad from Twilight. We even get to see how when you lose someone and how that causes friction between everyone else within the fire department one person is blaming this person and the other person is blaming that person and it's just like i understand y'all upset but y'all need to get it together overall i say ladder 49 it's basically an inoffensive movie it's basically sets out what it does it basically just chronicles the life of one fireman and his life within the fire department when he starts a family and it shows the dangers of becoming a fireman and it leads to his inevitable death. The best way I can describe this movie is it's basically a big budget lifetime movie that just happens to be about firemen. Plus, it's also a nice little reminder that whenever Joaquin Phoenix isn't doing weird roles, he can take, I guess, sane roles like this one right here. In fact, I do remember this movie came out at a time when Joaquin Phoenix's career was really starting to manifest. It came out a year before Walk the Line, which I've never seen. And this movie also came out at a time when John Travolta's career was beginning to dwindle a little bit, if that makes sense. But overall, you should definitely check it out if you haven't. And if you have seen it, tell me what you think about this movie in the comment section below. But I'm going to give Ladder 49 the thumbs up emoji. This is your boy Bankful B of The Last of the Factor. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Peace.